still waiting hours for high quality renders and spending a ton of money on a powerful PC? Well, it's time to change that. Let me introduce you to an amazing AI tool that gives you top quality professional renders in just a few seconds with just a few clicks and no need for a high-end system. Hi there, this is Nysaur, and every week I share awesome SketchUp tutorials just for you. If you enjoy this kind of content, don't forget to like and subscribe. It really keeps me going. Now let's jump in. Today we will work with an amazing, powerful AI tools. Before us all, let me tell you how and from where we can get that. On Google, search nystores.com. And from here, nice store website, find swap AI. Click on it. As you can see, here is swap AI website. Click on download. And today we will work with swap air. For download, click here, choose a location and click on save. As you can see, I download it. Now go to SketchUp. Extensions menu, extension manager, and install extension and find that plugin. Then click on open like this. Now let's active that, find it here for a SketchUp. As you can see, this is the icon of the air plugin. Click on the swap air window and then you will see this window here you can see the name of the swap air and on the left side you will find the recent projects section so up here at the top you have got a menu you have probably seen it already in this menu you will find different views and styles you just scroll through it and pick whatever works best for your project, depending on the view or web you're going for. Then next to the menu, there is a slider. This slider is about how creative or detailed the AI should be. Now down here, there is a checkbox. In this box, you can write something about your projects, like what you want, what you need, and more about your project. It helps the AI understand your idea better and give you more accurate results. And from here, you can upload an image. Sometimes you have a screenshot of your project. You can upload from here. And also from here, you can take a screenshot of your project. Let me refresh that. Like this. As you can see here, we have just a screenshot. Let me increase the accuracy. And from this window, choose a view for our project. Make sure the facade style matches your project. Modern with modern, classic with classic. As you can see here, we can see preview of the style. For example, this is good for our project. And at the end, come on create button. You will see something here. From here, you can choose how many pictures you want to take render. I choose just one. And keep material, it's super important. You can choose lower, medium, or high. This is so important. If you don't want to change the material of your project, choose high. I choose medium. And also you can describe about your project right here. I don't want to do it right now and click on create. So as you can see, it's ready. You can see after and before of the project. Now let me write a prompt, high quality, modern, Exterior Villa, click on Create. Now it's better than the first one. Wow, it's so amazing. Just 
by one click. Let's check the first one. Yeah, it has some problems right here. And the next one is better. Yeah, wow. It's so amazing. Without needing any powerful system, you can take just by a few click. And at the end, you can save your project. There is different format, JPG and PNG. I choose PNG and also different quality, HD or Ultra. I choose Ultra and click on Save. Maybe it takes a few moments. And then just click on Save. Wow, it's so amazing. And from here, we can edit something. One great thing about this plugin is that it lets you lighten your project. As you can see, we have different type of light. Let me change something. Wow, it's so amazing. Let me move it here. And also from here, we can increase or decrease radius of the light. It's so amazing. Wow. And also we can change the direction of the light. It's so amazing. It's so cool. Also, we can change the color of the light. Wow, so amazing. Let me take a copy, cut off the material and paste on the other. And at the end, click on create. Wow, it's so amazing. Let me save this one too. Click on save. Now let's try a classic villa right here. Open air swap and refresh the screenshot. So now let me delete this prompt and type another one, high quality classic villa. And also different style. And I think this one is suitable for our project because this is classic too. And choose keep material medium. Click on create. Maybe it takes a few moments. Wow, as you can see, it's ready. You can see before and after of the render. Now let's try it without a prompt. Delete the prompt and click on create. So what is new here? Wow, it's so great. Look at the cars and also the details. It's so amazing. So now let's try a tower. As you can see, there is a tower with a town. Let's take a render. From this tower. So let me refresh the screenshot. Go to this menu and choose a view for the tower. I think, as you can see, we have a preview of the tower. I think this one is great. Choose this one. And let's try with this prompt. Keep base details. Keep material, medium, click on create. This is not bad but there is some problems. Let's check that. Increase accuracy and try it again. 
now it's better look at that let me choose another style for example this one and and try it again wow it's it's better it's so good let me save that save now different view of the tower refresh the screen increase accuracy and also a different view for example this one and also keep material lower choose lower and click on create as you can see it's done it's it's really good i think it's really good let's try complex this one i think it's this one is better let's create that wow it's so great it's so cool wow look at the detail let me save that this is a powerful ai tools I hope this tutorial was useful and helpful for you. For more tutorials, please subscribe to our YouTube channel if you haven't already. And don't forget to like the video and share it with your friends.